this is Kimberly and I would like to welcome you back to my channel bookkeeping journey where I share my journey towards becoming a full-time bookkeeper and the knowledge that I have gained along the way today's video I am going to show you uh, where you go in QuickBooks online to create a check I am also going to show you where you go to order QuickBooks checks and explain the benefits of having QuickBooks checks on hand but before we go on I would like to ask you to subscribe to the channel, press that notification bell, and give this video a thumbs up. All right, so to create checks in QuickBooks, there's, there are different ways that you can go to create a check. The first way we're going to use is this new bun button up here. We're going to click on that on the vendors, go to the where you see vendors, go under there and click on check. When you click on check, um, it will bring up the check screen. So if the reason why we create checks is to eat, to pay our vendors, the people that we buy stuff from, if it's a new check, you will come in here, you will put in the person that you're going to pay, you will put in the service that you, the, you're paying them for, so if it's a legal service, if it's just a subscription, you're going to put that up here. If it's um, inventory items, then you put them down here. But if it's a vendor that you already have a bill for um, and you came in here to make that payment, you will click on pay and you will type in the, the vendor's name. So it's not a number, we will put him, click on him there and it will populate the bill that we are going to pay for him. All right, so I click add and that will add the bill and it will put it will bring us into the bill payment screen now then I will put in now the check number 3204 and I can come in here now and I can print the check but before we print checks um, I am before we go to this print check I am going to click on order check so you can see what um, a QuickBooks check looks like. So I'm going to click on order checks and let's say we were running low, we need more checks. So this is where you will come to order your QuickBooks checks. Choose whichever check you would like to order. Um, I'm just going to click on this one, the middle one, since it says most popular. Um, and then it will bring me into the check ordering screen and you see how this is how it will um, print out. So it, it does the check and it does the stubs after. I will click on get started. And then I will fill in all the information here. So you put in the company name. I'm just going to put in my channel name here. Sorry, I have on caps lock. So don't know why I do that. Bookkeeping journey. But I put in my account number. I'm um, just going to make up one. So I, so I put in the account number. Um, I, I put, put keeping journey there. Number of signatures one. I only it's only me that's going to sign the check. If it's more than one person, you will come down and click on two if you want. Let's click on two and see how it looks. So you see, it puts an extra line there. Um, but we're just going to use one line. Then the color, I am girly, so I will click that color. Oh, please enter your banking information. So let's say bank of bookkeeping. Bank of bookkeeping. One, two, four, five, nine, eight. And that's it. Uh, let's see now the preview check. And I make sure that every single thing is in the check first check number is that and, not, and then the others will count on obviously we scroll down we make sure everything is correct that is correct and let's see if it says add to cart it says confirm your routing and accounting numbers we couldn't verify so obviously you will have to confirm that but this one is obviously fake close it out and then you go in here and you order 
you're not we're not coming here to order anything let's close out of that let me close out of that okay so then you see the process of uh, process of ordering checks so let's say we do have checks and we're going to print check and then you click on print check because we're going to print it to send it to Norton yes everything here is correct click yes and you would have remembered this was in the when we did um, bill payment this was the screen that we went into to order checks if you watched that video if you haven't you can go ahead and watch it after this one um, so that's perfect preview and print click on preview and print oh 32 04 see it didn't add a check number and it reminded me preview and print and the best thing about having QuickBooks checks now is that as you can see the information populates here so all of that would would all of this information will be printed on the check and so therefore I didn't have to write anything on my checks um, I didn't have to write anything on the check and it makes it so easy all I have to do now is sign the check when it comes out and that's it I click close yes they are all printed correctly yes and I click done and I'm going to close it up here and the second way now to show you where you can go and um, print checks as well is you go into expenses um, you can click on new transaction you can do a check from in here or you can go to vendors and you select the vendor we're gonna so you're gonna choose person Bersanahan and but this one but obviously this one let me show you this one if you wouldn't know so this one now will not be a blank one this will bring up Boston and insurance information and it will populate any open bills that he has that's it for the video today I'm just going to close out of that I just want to thank you so much for watching if you have any comments put it in the comment section below and may you enjoy the rest of your day bye